PSG player Aminata Diallo released from police custody without charge, but investigation into attack is ongoing, her release signifies that at this stage the charges are not sufficient to put her before an investigating judge and to put her under formal investigation. However, the investigation is ongoing to identify the attackers and their potential accomplices. If new elements become available and concern Miss Diallo, she may need to be brought back into proceedings, Kalebot added. Detention as part of an investigation is common in France and prosecutors have 48 hours to charge or release a person if they are brought in. No one has been charged in the case, details of the incident according to the New York Times, PSG midfielder Kyra Hamraoui was being driven home by Diallo when the car was pulled over by two masked men and Hamraoui was pulled from the vehicle. She was reportedly beaten on her legs with metal bars, as Diallo was held. Hamraoui was left badly bruised, but with no broken bones in her legs, the New York Times reported. Paris Saint-Germain condemns in the strongest possible terms the violence committed, the club said in a statement earlier this week. The club continues to support its players to allow them to overcome this ordeal as soon as possible the statement read. Paris Saint-Germain reiterates its confidence in the justice system to shed full light on the events. The club would like to thank everyone for showing restraint and respecting the presumption of innocence as well as the privacy of the team. The club said it has taken all necessary measures to guarantee the health and safety of its entire team. Paris Saint-Germain is working with the Versailles police to clarify the facts. The club is paying close attention to the progress of the proceedings and will study what action to take. Diallo started for PSG in their 4-0 win over Real Madrid in the UEFA Women's Champions League on Tuesday. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.